Sempre sapa sali Hey Stina manji kamba tola gali Hey Tisha sa pupa sonki sizo mzanzi Hey Kulezi tu sizo kiyali Jena urafundi Masesa panje siya kojo Izi gay bad lady Because it's sense in the world So Now to a yena Kwenye step to jomu kwa huye Nisha sa pide sa sisi sa nji Afige ame la kwa mpaja Lepo uso na uti Uko na mpaja I feel like it is so much easier to be able to have access to testing in our school premises other than be the ones to go to town and maybe see like people that we know that might judge us for going into those testing tents or maybe going into a clinic where we see someone where um, they know our parents or like something like that and they can have, have a lot to assume and a lot to say about us testing. I think it's very advisable because not most parents take their children to go for testing because they'd be like, ah, I know we all fine in this family. I know we all negative. It's always important to know your status regardless of the age because some people like get tested when they're at the age of 21 or 22, some even 30, and then come to find out that the virus has been living in them for like the past 20 years and they haven't been treating it. Some parents don't really tell their children if they have HIV and as we know if you are a baby and you happen to be breastfed by your mother you could get the virus easily so it could be helpful to find out if you do have it that would help m many people know their status for safety reasons. I think testing in schools would work properly in a way that maybe we have a specific day where we do HIV testing and like within the different periods maybe goes a different grade maybe period one is matrix and period two is grade 11 also to just like you know not have that much um, chaos happening and to give the person testing like time and to like test different grades so that we know okay everyone is testing on this day rather than have just like random testing days you know It's the Friday.